going on everybody of the intro net back out here in Johnson Valley bro uh, got mr. 650r cowboy with me or Martin or Martin whatever you want to call him Martin 650r cowboy I think my tires are a little bit too much air pressure for this uh, hard pack shit because I'm like just spinning out. I hope you enjoyed the little bit of a time lapse I had at the beginning of the video. I got out here about 8.45 this morning and him and I were both spending like the last hour, hour and 15 minutes just doing some stuff with the bikes. Kicking it out drift style. Going Tokyo Drift with this shit. This is now the first video with the new Phoenix handlebars that are 100 millimeter rise. Whoa. So, there's a lot of people, a lot more people out here than I'm used to. It's all these guys here, all these guys. There's a lot more back here behind me. Oh my god, I can already tell a difference with these Phoenix handlebars. So much nicer with these bars. Oh, he's going that way. Ah. So today's Sunday, uh, May 26th, I want to say. Got a three day weekend this weekend, so at least myself I do. I had yesterday, the Saturday off, today's Sunday. I got tomorrow off, which is nice. So I'm just going to kind of, what? oh shit. I almost hit that rock hardcore, dude. That's why sometimes I like to sit down in some of these rocky sections because it's... Because trying to be standing up and stuff is good, but... Maybe sometimes with me, it's just a personal thing. I don't feel like I can always throw the bike around as much while I'm standing up. Because my center of gravity is a little bit higher. Now it is a good thing to stand up.
but at the end of the day it all depends on it all depends on the situation Like right now it doesn't matter because I'm not going to be like making a bunch of erratic maneuvers and stuff. I'm just kind of ah. like that would have probably bucked me around a little bit. And like some of these whoops like this, this is good to stand up on but then your legs get super tired. And worn out anyways I'm not gonna keep rambling on about standing up and sitting down on a bike you gotta do what you gotta do to make yourself comfortable and not wreck Down, down range, look down range. Don't focus right here, focus up there. I see that big rock right there, so I know to go around it. So if you're watching this, And you've made it this far so far in the video. And you ride motorcycles, whether it's dirt bikes or street bikes. Tell me where your favorite place to ride. And if you don't... If you don't ride motorcycles... but you like to go exploring let me know where your favorite place is that you've been to or you go to regularly whether it's to go camping hiking or exploring or wherever me off hell of bad it's always the little things that you don't realize that will screw you up bad ah. now getting into the rockier sections I've been here before, it's been a while since August. See, this is why I like the desert, man. Look at this.
okay. Ah. Oh, my heart just dropped. I started getting the death wobbles like. Ugh. If I didn't let off the gas right there, I would have had tank slappers. I started doing this really bad. Yes, even though I don't ride street bikes, us dirt bikers will still get death wobble tank slappers. That's a nice boulder. See, the whole bike just starts doing that uh, shit. Because all the weight's on the back end. And the back end's trying to dig, and it's just... Shift the fourth. Take the high road sometimes. Watch out for rocks like that, man. There's flicker and snot. Standing on the, I don't know if it's the ball of my feet, ah! right underneath my toes, or right behind my toes. I'm here with you, bud. Don't worry. forward a little bit to get the weight on the front just a tad bit be on the right side because dust is covering the left side ah. I hate that I hate when my freaking front tire does that kind of shit and grabs these rocks. Throws me off my game, man. feeling liquid on my arms and it's like oh my vent tube for my freaking gas cap is not even connected but I'm like can't do anything while I'm doing fucking mock Jesus down freaking the worst kind of trail possible
Yeah, I'm good. Don't go there. Don't yeah. Go I don't care either way. All right. Let's go check this shit out. Oh yeah, this is all granite right in here, bro. So gotta be hella careful in here not to dump the clutch. First, first gear. It's doable though. You want to try this first? Huh? That's all right. We'll get it. Gear all the way up. All right, turn this off. Hey, bro, if I made this shit on a two fifty two stroke. Yo ass ain't got no problems on a 650. You say, oh, I'm happier than shit with this. Ah. All right, he waved me to come back down. No orders. All right, I'm gonna just cut. Ah. Boing, I hear you. I hear you calling, but I'm not answering the phone right now. I'm, I'm fucking busy. All right, let's go. mountain biking it <laughs> what happened you good Man, my oh fuck. You good though? I lifted out and I went like Whoa. Question is, is are you good? Yeah, I'm fine. Go. You're not hurt? Is it? Yeah. Hey, the only important thing is as long as you're good, yeah. nothing else fucking matters, dog. Yeah, no, I'll up, so I just did first gear all the way up. Maybe second? Yeah. Maybe second? Uh, right. Are we going to be able to fix that muffler? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Like, it's still. You can, uh, you can still ride today, though, right? Yeah. Uh, I, yeah, let me uh, get this bike to work and all right, all right, I'll, I'll give me a second. Let me put this first gear. All right, let me. Yeah, 
<laughs> All right, hold on. This Cletus ain't happy here. <laughs> hold on. No, I got this. I just gotta pull in the clutch. You know what? Sideways. Nope, that ain't gonna work. Well, it's either the safety of you or the bike, dude. Like, we can always get you out of here. We can always get the bike out of here. Can't always get you out of here. Oh, fuck, I'm fat ass, dude. I'm fucking. I got you. Uh. So what do you want me to do to help you just lift? Keep the bike stable. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'll kind of pull on it too a little bit. Oh fuck! I got all the way. Uh, this thing's heavy as hell. Uh, are you sure? There it goes. All right. This damn rut right here, man. Shit. <laughs> well, with this. Okay, yeah. And it'll get caught too much grip and just. <laughs> <laughs> I got up here. I'm like, I saw these big ass rocks. I'm like, dude, I'm done. But I don't know. I I was up here on the right, but I went over that flat faced rock right there on the right. Yeah. Fucking, I was first gear just brought like. Hey, you're good. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Is this thing gonna be able to? All right. Here, get on the bike. I got you covered. Uh, yeah. You want me to grab the helmet first? Yeah. All right. The one time a 250 actually fucking helped me out. Uh -huh. Right? With you having the... Right. But with this big ass bike, dude, this thing weighs, what, 450 pounds? Yeah, but it's the gearing is what the problem is. My gearing is all. Yo. When I, when I dial it down, like if I had to do like yours, yours is like a real slow. Mine's 1451. Mine is uh, 1548. Yeah, so if you went to uh, 14. I'd, I'd do the same exact gearing she had. It. Yeah. 1451, dude. You'll be, you'll be golden. Yep. And, uh, 51 on the back right and then a 14 on the front. Yep. You got it? Yep. I'll, I'll hang out here till I know you got it. You're in first right now. Uh. 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 Oh yeah, I forgot to put my bike in first gear. I do not recommend anybody mountain bike on their dirt bike. Oh, it's his bike. That's squeaky. I'm like, what the? <laughs> I went up that. I did the same thing. I went up the left side and I came out this way over here. I kind of made a straight line. Uh, yeah, it happens. Uh, mountain bike. Uh. Huh? Uh, about to die. Ah, uh. dude, get on the bike and mountain bike it. It's easier. Ah. Uh. Uh. 
big rocks. Oh shit. Ah, ow. Because he did that, I slammed on my front brakes and almost broke my wrist right now. Fuck. You good? Ow. Don't ever. Oh uh, fuck. Now I'm in a bad situation. Damn it. If ain't one of us, it's both of us. How do I not ride so good? Even though I've been riding for 20 years, 23 years. Huh? Uh. Uh. I, I say beer 30 or what? All right. What do we call that? The demon trail? And I got halfway of it. Thing I didn't hear your bike. I'm like, uh oh. <laughs> yeah, right into the gut. That thing get bent up or does it just slip out? Oh, okay. Oh, I see. Yeah. The thing doesn't line up with this bow hole. I need to get him back at four. Oh, okay. Hey, you ain't riding right if you ain't doing trail maintenance. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. We spent an hour and a half working on both of our bikes this morning. 